Hello all. So let's discuss a very small topic, okay? But a quite a bit confusing topic. So that's why I choose to make video on this. So we will dis we'll be discussing the difference between holes electrons and positive ions and negative ions. That is electron hole pair that is occurring in our semiconductors and what is positive ions and negative ions actually. So I am taking the help of let's say one semico silicon semiconductor. So as we all know. Silicon has four electrons in its outermost orbit. So they share them this and make one covalent bond, right? These all are silicon atoms. So sharing this electron, okay, they will make this covalent bond. Right? Now and this we represent it like this that this is our valence band and this is our conduction band. So from valence band now, now this electron which are these electrons these are in our valence band okay they are not free because they are bonded by this covalent bond but as we apply energy they will jump to a higher energy level okay from ec to ev right so let's say we apply one some energy and let's say this uh, bond is broken so this electron is now free and over here hole is created and now this electron is now here and it is free to roam right and it jumps towards conduction band so if there is a electron hole pair generation okay within the same semiconductor that is this electron is of the same semiconductor right that is of this silicon atom only it has jumped to higher energy level but of that silicon semiconductor only that is again let me explain that this is as we all know all our orbitals and in different orbits our electrons reside so let's say these two are the electrons in this orbit right so what happens is that when this electrons is being bonded with covalent bond okay we can't it can't move okay so it is not free it is not in conduction band over here it is ec so when we give energy okay by increasing temperature or anything then it moves to this higher orbit which has some higher energy and over here one hole is created so this electron okay moved from lower energy orbit or we can say lower orbit to higher orbit right higher energy orbit okay within same semiconductor only this is same within the same semiconductor only but what what will happen within the same semiconductor but what will happen in case of ions okay this generation is called electron hole pair generation okay if this happens then only the electron hole pair will generate but what happens in case of ions on the other side as we all know very famous example nacl so over here Na will have positive charge and Cl will have negative charge. Okay, over here the whole Na atom is positive. It means that this Na atom is denoting its electron since we know that in any atom we have nucleus at the center, it has protons and it has electron cloud in the outermost okay, orbits. And this charge is this overall atom is neutral, that is, number of protons is same as number of electrons. But over here, what happens? For stability, in order to gain stability, this Na, that is sodium atom, will denote one electron to this chlorine atom and it will accept it. So, what will happen now? Before there was neutrality, overall electrical neutrality due to the equal number of protons and electrons. But now, this Na atom, so let's consider this is an Na sodium atom. So, this sodium atom has now denoted one electron. So, overall protons will be more. So it will gain positive charge and this is called ion and this uh, electron from sodium atom is taken by this chlorine in order to gain the stability to complete the octet. So overall what will happen now let's say this is our chlorine. So over here one electron of Na will come so overall number of protons will remain same. So overall the charge will be negative since one extra electron has came as compared to before. So these are called ions. Overall atom over here will have positive. Whereas in this case, in the same semiconductor, when one electron jumps, okay, 
from higher lower orbit to higher orbit over here one hole is created this electron jumped right so overall what will happen the overall atom will remain neutral only this whole silicon atom will remain neutral right so this is the difference between electron hole pair generation and between the positive and negative ions right so when the the bottom line is if the electron leave its own atom okay then it become charge but if it is jumping within the same semiconductor within its home only then we can't say it is a ion okay it is just a electron hole pair generation correct so this is a very small topic and small misconception so i cleared that thank you